Welcome back everyone. Today we are going to show how to unzip a map and be able to access the files to go into Giants Editor to work on it uh, and then to zip it back up again and that's that's what this is about. I've had a video about it a little bit before but someone's having an issue and I'm hoping to explain a little further. One of my subscribers is trying to fix something they're having problems with and I'm hoping I can clarify it. If not, sorry, uh, you can ask me, me your question again and maybe I can uh, figure out what it is your, your actual problem is. So, but we're, we're in the farming simulator.com site, it's farming simulator dash sim, farming dash simulator.com area. You're going to click on mods, you're going to roll, pick out a map. I picked out this one, but it's going to take too long to download, as you can see. I ain't waiting on that, but I wanted to show you where you can get a map. And uh, make sure you're on the 22 if you're trying to get 22. It should say FS19, which that means that one is not highlighted, which is kind of weird how they have it. But this is the 22 side. If you click that, it would go to 19. But anyway, so we're going to go ahead and get started. Hope everybody's having a wonderful day. Appreciate all the new subscribers. Welcome to the channel. We'll go ahead to download. Pretend that just finished downloading. I'm just going to grab this one and pretend that's the map that I chose. We're going to click on this one. As you can see, it's zipped up. I'm going to right click and I'm going to click copy in this page, in this case so I can paste it in my documents folder, uh, in the mods folder. Because in this case, we want to use it as the map uh, in the map area uh, or the mods area to open the map in the Giants Editor. And then we'd have it already there when we want to test the map. But if you're just learning to unzip and zip you don't have to move it you can just leave it in here and then make a new folder in here title it throw it in there or make a copy of it first and then go paste it in the new folder and work from there you don't have to put it in the mods folder if you don't want to if you're not going to be doing map stuff like if you've just got something you need to unzip and you don't care about farming sim at all that's what you would do what I'm about to show you but you don't have to do this this particular step uh, because you don't have to put it in the documents folder so I already hit copy let me make sure I did and then we're going to go to documents and then my games double click with the left mouse button farming sim 22 left mouse and you're going to double click it mods double click right well we're not going to right click it here we're going to name a folder or a new folder and we're just going to call it uh, test test so we don't mix it up we'll see what I don't have any name that so we're going to click on that and you can you can either right click on it after you highlight it and paste it or open it double click on it with the left mouse button to open it and then right click and then click paste it's going to put the map in here you can see it zipped up we'll go ahead and change the view to a large icon so you can see it's zipped up you got the zipper here and you want to have a folder that doesn't have the zipper and you want to unzip it so you're going to right click on it after it's highlighted and you can click extract all if you have that option that's all you would have to do is click that right there or you could come to 7-zip if you have that program and use it and then you would come over here and go extract to fs22 underscore hobo Hobo's hollow underscore four times. So you're going to click this one if you have 7-zip, okay? So we're going to do 7-zips right now. But if you have that one, you can click it. I usually can click that one. Extract all. But this one works too. So we're going to click extract all, extract two, and then it's going to put it in this folder, okay? And once it does, you can see we have it. It's an empty folder. I mean a blank, it's not blank, it's a unzipped folder with all the contents. You can double click and now that we have all the stuff. And if you was going to work on that map, double click on map, come here to map uh, I3D right there and double click it and then you would open it. I'm not going to open it, but basically you pick the one of these, the Giants Editor version you want, which in this case you would want 9.0.6 because it's a Farm and Sim 22 map, and then you hit OK. If it's a 19 map you're working on, you're going to want to use the 8.2.2 8 .2 map uh, version. And then you just hit OK to open up to the Giants Editor, um, which is this. 
this is the Giants editor. It'll open up the map in there and then you can work on it. But we're not going to work on it, so we're going to click cancel. All right, so now that you have that, say you're done with it. Say you did work on it and you saved it. And now you're like, well, I need to zip it up now. Okay, well, if you need to zip it, there's going to be a different way you do it. You would think that you just take the folder that's zipped and right click on it, come here, and then zip it up. Uh, but it's it's not. You got to do it differently. So you're going to open this up. Then you see this stuff that's inside that folder. You're going to left click here, hold it down, drag it up to highlight just that, all that stuff right there. Right click on the highlighted area. Okay. You got it. And then you're going to go to whatever program you have. Seven zip is what I've got here, or I could go to send to whichever you have compressed zip that just means you're going to zip this up okay so I'm going to go to 7-zip since we used 7-zip while ago and I'm going to come over here and you're going to read these and see which one you need to do and I believe the right one or there's several ways you can do it some of them it depends on which one you need I'm thinking we would click add to this one let me see compress to that and email I don't want to email no I don't want the email add to no compress an email add to archive okay I think we're gonna go add to and then it's gonna title it this so we're gonna click this one add to fs22 underscore the map name underscore 4x zip so we're gonna click that one and it's gonna zip that up for you and it's gonna pop that name up with all those so this middle one is the name of the map with all this other stuff inside this so these things that you see highlighted around this this map name is inside this zipped folder now so that's all that is so if you needed to title this map you would do it here you would click on it and title it but you're going to want to add this first part fs22 underscore and then you would put whatever map name you had. If you don't, it won't work in the game. If you just leave it as a regular name, it's not going to open. It's not going to open the map. Okay? So that this, once you've got it zipped back up again, you would highlight it like it is. Right click. Click cut because you're taking it away from here because this, this is already inside this folder now because you, you just zipped up maps, placeables, icons, mod desk and preview into this so you're taking it from here and putting it in your mods folder so click back to your mods folder right click in a white area and click paste now you've got it in there and it's zipped up but now you can go in game check it do what you got to do and it should work because you got your fs22 underscore and your map and again usually you want to put it in an empty folder if you're trying to unzip it so say i see it i see it here I'm like, oh, I need to do something. I would typically put it in another folder and then paste it to work on it. Now, in this case, I already have one in here, and you, you get this option when you already have it. So I'm obviously not going to keep it because I already have it, so I'm just going to not do anything, right? I'm not going to put it in here because I already have it in here. But basically, this is your zipped one, and this is your unzipped one, okay? So that's all of its contents. This is so you can access all the things you need to work on a map. If you're new to map making, I have a lot of tutorials on my channel. Go look at it. It's, it says Giants Editor Tutorials or whatever on my channel. And you can look through a bunch of them uh, for Farming Sim 19 and 22. So, and in this case, for the mod desk, you could right click in here. And then you could open it uh, with whatever you need or i have the uh, edit with notepad plus plus i would click that and then it would let you edit it so this gets you inside the map to be able to do stuff with it uh click in here and it has other options in here that you can get in there to the placeables right click edit with notepad plus plus and then you could go work on that part of it whatever you got to do you'd have access if you can unzip it Okay, so I hope that makes sense. And if you click on this blank one, right, right click on it, you notice it don't show you that extract anymore. You know why? 
because it's not going to give you that option because it's already open. So you shouldn't even have the option to extract it because it's already open. Okay. So then you click on the zipped one and watch. There's the extract option. Why? Because you can extract it because it's zipped. So the one that's zipped has the option to extract. Has the option to extract. The one that's the one that's unzipped don't even have the option to extract. None of that's there. The option over here where it said extract all is not there. You see it's not in the list because you can't. So I hope that helps. I was trying to help. Um, you know, if you, if you don't, if you didn't get it or some other issue or maybe you don't have those particular programs and it looks a little different, uh, let me know and I can try to help. But I just wanted to try to show a little, little updated version of how to unzip your, you know, compressed file or your folder some call it and uh or how to zip it back up again uh and put it in the map to work on it in the giants editor and for playing it in the game because you got to have it in the mods folder and it has to say fs22 underscore but i hope you enjoyed i'm gonna call that an episode don't forget to hit the like button subscribe turn on your notification be bell if you want to receive a notification every time i post a video goodbye everybody